Hey you guys, what's going on? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. I'm pumped for today's video as I am for most videos, but this one especially because I think this concept turned out really cool. We're going to be attempting Christmas light skull today. So buckle up and let's get into it. I feel pretty confident about this look, but I also am like a healthy level of scared. So I don't know how much I'm gonna talk through this because I'm figuring it out as we go too. This might be one of those videos where I do a lot of voiceover or maybe I'll just figure it out as we go. I don't know, but we're doing this together, so. Initially, I'm gonna start with a white eye pencil because I want to kind of start marking out where things are gonna go. And I think white is a good color. This product is also a good product. It blends away really well. I used to do full faces and only this, so. Okay, so that's some jaw and mouth framing. Maybe I will just use eyeliner today. Back in the day before I actually even had paint and I wanted to do full face looks, like full face paint, I just used the NYX Jumbo Pencil and I created so many looks with it. I'm just blending it out with a sponge to see if that really even does anything. It kind of does. Now I do think I need to create some dimension in here just so that it doesn't get lost when I put white over the rest of the face. This is the Morphe 39L palette. This is one of my favorite palettes ever for this shade specifically. As you can tell, I've used it a lot. And I got a little ahead of myself because we are going to use taupe first. So after the taupe outline, I just started going in with all of the colors. And for me, what I found worked really well was just doing like teardrop shapes. So I was so focused on what I was seeing and doing like in front of me that I did not give enough care to what you guys would be seeing. So unfortunately, you can't see anything that I'm doing for a portion of these clips, but I'm just doing teardrop shapes with all those colors back and forth. Of course, my air just turned on and so now it's really loud. But honestly, NYX, like jumbo pencil, is such a good replacement for face paint it just works so well and it's so easy to remove and fix and mwah, good job nix So how this went for me was initially I would just drop all of the little like light bulb teeth shapes 
in the right colors in order and then once I was done and they were all on I would just go back in and deepen them up and add the details. All right, y'all, I'm kind of a mess. Uh, my phone died at some point while I was doing this, and I'm not sure at what point. We'll find out on the edit. It was fine. Y'all hardly missed anything. But while I was waiting for it to charge, I did start adding some of the, like, black detailing. I'm going to do, I think, a liquid liner also, but we were starting with some shadow. Now I'm going to finish off the details in the light bulb because I feel like it's really going to start coming together once those details are in there. Pulling out Riviera for that white shade because, oh. Oh, by the way, for all the little details that I'm creating with my water liner, I'm using the Suva Beauty Doodle Pot. If you're listening, I love you. So I think we're going to do glam eye and then I will do circles of Christmas lights. So after that, we went back in with that taupe shade and started to make the circles for the eyeballs.
And then it was time to do the light detailing again. And yeah, I, I you know, I'm so sorry. I'm I'm going to get better about making sure you guys can see what's going on because some of these angles are freaking rough. Okay, I have a meeting in half an hour. I'm gonna try and get through as many details as I can. All right, my loves, I will be back, right back for you. It'll be probably an hour for me. Uh, and then we will finish this up. Okay, all right. All right, y'all, we are back for the moment. I need to put eyelashes on, and then I figured I would do my hair and stuff off camera. Let's find some lashes that we like. My lash curler that just became extra manual because I broke it somehow. All right, there's one. All right, y'all, I'm gonna go do my hair and then I will come back to deliver the finished look. Hey guys, I'm back and obviously this is the finished look. I am in love, I love it. This has been, what time is it? This has consumed the last like six and a half hours of my life. So a lot of dedication went into this today. But I really do love how this turned out and I'm really excited and looking forward to all of the looks that I have coming up for the holiday season. Should be a lot of interesting content both here and on my TikTok. So if you like seeing what I'm doing, if you want to see these looks before they actually come out, make sure you have my live notifications on because a lot of times when I'm doing the look and I take a break from filming, I go live on TikTok to finish up whatever I'm doing. So you can always catch a sneak peek or an early glimpse of a new look or a new video on my TikTok. But with all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, put like a little skull and a Christmas tree emoji in the comments if you were this far into the video. But yeah, that's it, y'all. I love you guys so much. I hope the rest of your days are merry and bright and I will see you in my next one. Bye.